the first triad that we're going to use, a triad is, a, you know, the one, yeah. three, and five, okay? So we can play an A, obviously, up here, okay? We can play a G here, okay? We can also play an inversion here of an A, okay? What that is, is if you think about it, like here's your A triad, but sometimes we don't want that, like, that just sounds da, 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 like that. It just sounds a little bit canned. So what you do is add your fifth, no, your third right here. Okay, that is your A. What's that? G. Okay. And then here's um, another D. Sorry, I'm a little bit out of tune there. There's an A, okay, okay, here's another inversion for a D. Okay. Okay, so, so what you can do is go from a major triad here with this inversion, First inversion, remember what's a first inversion? Versus a second yeah. inversion? Moving the... The third. You move the yeah. third right. in front. Second inversion, <laughs> you move the fifth in front. I knew, I knew that's what you were thinking. So, look at this. You can make it a um, <clears throat> first inversion, minor, A minor, G minor, okay, F minor, E minor, by putting that minor there, you're leading off the chord with the minor, first inversion. All the way down. Okay, that's a lot of chords right there, just with those shapes. Okay, I want you to put those into some...